guys, Tyler here with ACSL. Today we're gonna to do a quick unboxing of the Soten drone. So a little bit of background on ACSL. Um, the Soten is manufactured in Japan, so it's fully NDA compliant. Um, we've got a few different bundle options. The one we're looking at today is the survey bundle. Uh, so it's gonna come with multiple batteries, a smart controller, um, as well as a few other accessories. Um, we've got some uh, other bundles that come with just single batteries and a standard controller, as well as some more specialized bundles uh, for different payload applications as well. So let's go ahead and pull out the Soten here. So as you can see, it's all folded up. You can just click these arms in place. You'll notice the obstacle avoidance sensors on the top, front, and bottom of the drone. Uh, your battery compartment here in the back. And then I'll show you how to swap payloads here in just a minute. Then we've got our Tenso Smart Controller, like I mentioned. So you've got a built-in screen here. Um, we also have a standard controller if you want to use your own device. Um, and then on the bottom, you have uh, an HDMI output as well. Then we've got our multi-charger that holds three batteries. Um, and then the survey, survey bundle is going to come with a total of five batteries. So you've got your two additional ones up here. The payload that comes in the survey bundle is the 20 megapixel mechanical shutter. So that's our standard payload. And then you've got two locations to store your propellers. So down here under the aircraft itself, and then we've got another spare set up here at the top of the, uh, of the case. And then just a couple uh, charging cables and charging block for the batteries themselves. And that's a look at the survey bundle. All right, now that we've got everything out of the case, we'll go ahead and get some set up uh, and ready for flight. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna install our payload. So as I mentioned, you have swappable payloads with Soten. Um, the survey bundle comes with the standard payload. So if you come up here to the front of the drone, payload slides right into the front and you'll hear it click into place. Uh, the button over here is on the side uh, to take the payload off. You just press the button, payload slides right off. Next, we'll take our battery, which goes in the back of the drone here. So again, just slides right into the back of the drone and you'll hear that click into place as well. And then finally, we'll take our propellers. These are all labeled um, on the arms and on the uh, propellers themselves. They can't go in the wrong place, um, but they are labeled. You just do a press down and twist to lock those in place. And we're all set up, ready for flight. So real quick, we'll take a look at the Tenso Smart Controller that's included. So on the controller itself, you've got a couple customizable buttons up here along the top. Um, down here on the bottom, you've got an HDMI output if you want to send that, uh, that video stream to another screen. And then within Tenso itself, through our takeoff application, you can obviously do all your manual flight with Soten, as well as pre-planned missions. So you've got options to do waypoint missions, survey missions, as well as corridor missions. You can also set up a geofence if you have an area that you need to stay within. Um, and then, like I mentioned too, all your manual flight is through our ACSL takeoff application as well. All right, so with the survey bundle that we just put together, um, really specialized for the mapping photogrammetry type use case with that 20 megapixel standard payload. It has a mechanical shutter as well, which makes it perfect for mapping. Another bundle option that we've got is our thermal bundle, um, which is gonna feature our newest payload. This is a FLIR Hadron sensor. It's a 640 by 512 radiometric, as well as a 64 megapixel optical camera and it also has a 20 times zoom. So as I mentioned before, super easy to swap these out. And everything that we just mentioned in the survey bundle is included. And then in the thermal bundle, we're gonna include this new payload um, that gives you that thermal functionality. So this kind of opens you up for you know, public safety use case, for search and rescue, other inspection type use cases where you need thermal. Um, and in addition to the thermal bundle, we also have a multi-spectral payload that we've got a bundle built around for that agriculture type use case. Um, and then we also have a zoom payload as well. So that's a quick look at the Soten and thanks for watching.